take you to Asia, boy, to round the guy. And I'm back with another motherfucking video, man. What's poppin' TDG gang? What's good with y'all, TDG gang? <clears throat> Excuse me, gang. I'm getting over a cold. My Zay got me sick. My youngest son got me sick. So, you know, I'm just starting to feel a little bit better. Feeling a little windy. As y'all don't know, I probably didn't tell y'all in my, um, my get to know me video, which I really need to check, check, check that out. Get to know me, who is me, to the God is, uh, for the people who's down fucking with me personally. Um, I have asthma, so you know, I got a lot of things wrong with me. You know, from asthma to you know, allergies. You know, it all comes from the side of my. Uh, side of my dad family but like when i get sick you know my asthma starts flaring up and it's just a lot of bad so yesterday i didn't get to really get the chance to fucking upload because i was down in the dumps i really couldn't breathe like today i feel a little bit better but i would say i'm only at i would say i'm at 40 percent i'm not at 50 percent i'm at 40 percent but I, I, but I feel enough better to to give y'all some motherfucking videos, man. And y'all know what today is. Y'all know what today is. Today is Throwback Thursday. So I got a special, special treat for y'all, TDG gang. We finna get into the Notorious B.I.G. Notorious Thugs featuring Bone Thugs and Harmony. This is what we're going to get into today, man. Make sure y'all hit that like button, hit that comment section, hit that big red subscribe button because it's free to come join the family. Share my videos out too. Hit the post notification bell right next to it to, it, to get every motherfucking new video that me to got upload. We over here spending nothing but love, peace, and respect. Make sure y'all follow me on Instagram at Toretta Guy. We all on the road in 1K TDG game and all my new members out there. Make sure y'all follow. Oh, I already said that. I mean, without further ado, let's get into the motherfucking video, man. Throwback Thursday. Let's get into this shit, man. Notorious Thugs. Hold on, man. All right, gang. My bad. All right, let's get it, gang. Let's go. song bone thug and biggie ever made because i'm mad if this is the only motherfucking song that these that bone thugs and biggie made man they have such chemistry on here you know the blood thongs and harmony the way the singing and they can rap their asses off too they from the midwest they from ohio right right next door to us so this this is classic and this is very special <laughs> No angel dust, label us notorious. Thug ass niggas that love the bus, it's strange to us, yo. 
academics be scrambling, gambling on restaurants with mandolins and violins. We just sitting here trying to win, trying not to sin. High off weed and lots of gin. Yeah. So much smoke, we lots of gin. Yeah. Suddenly counting Benjamins. Nigga, you should too. Biggie flown is, bro. Biggie flown is, man. His flow is so smooth. His flow is so smooth. Bro, it's nobody. Nobody did it better than Biggie, bro. From his storytelling to when he had issues with the whole death row, the West Coast, East Coast shit. I mean, I really want to say Biggie had Biggie had um problems with the West Coast, East Coast shit because the day Tupac got shot, Biggie was Biggie was trying to go up to the hospital to see Pop. When Biggie got the information that Pac got shot, Biggie was Biggie was hurt. He was like, whoa, whoa. He said, yo, I got to get up to the hospital. So I feel like it, it, it should have never been beef between Biggie or Pac because they was generally friends. And Pac wasn't from, Pac wasn't from L.A. Pac was from New York. So I didn't understand what the whole East Coast, West Coast thing. When Pac, when Pac, you from New York. And Biggie had genuine respect for you. Biggie really thought you was his motherfucking friend. So I didn't understand. Why would you think Biggie was the one that was going to set you up? Biggie seen you. He seen you come into the studio. He said, and when the homie hit him up, was like, when the homie Biggie was in the studio, homie, the homie hit, hit Biggie up. He, the... When a biggie homie seen Pac coming in, he was like, yo, Pac. Pac was like, what's good? And he was like, yo, Pac downstairs, Biggie. He was like, oh yeah, bring him up. And then that, that whole thing escalated and Pac blamed Biggie. Why would you, Biggie was the one that told you to come let you up. Nothing but res genuine respect. So I, I didn't like the whole, the whole East Coast, West Coast shit, man. I, I thought that shit was unfair to all hip hop. It's for all hip hop fans to see both of these men die at a young age because it shouldn't have never escalated that far. Let's get back into it. I want to take it back to Biggie verse though. Scrambling, gambling, on restaurants with mandolins and violins. We just sitting here trying to win, trying not to sin. Yeah. High off weed and lots of gin. So much smoke, we lots of gin. Suddenly counting Benjamins. Nigga, you should too, if you knew what this game would do to you. Yeah. Been in this shit since 92. Right. Look at all the bullshit I've been through. So you heard what he said? Been in this shit since 92. You don't know what the bullshit I've been through. Let him know. Gin, so much smoke, we got the gin. Suddenly counting Benjamins. Nigga, you should too. If you knew what this game would do to you, been in this shit since 92. Look at all the bullshit I've been through. So called beef with you know who. Fuck a few female stars or two. Then I'm blue like niggas, blue like my shit. Not to be fucked with. Motherfuckers better duck quick. Cause me and my dogs love to fuck shit. Fuck the luck shit, strip the aim. No aspirations to quit the game. Spit your game, fuck your shit. Grab your gap, call your clip. Squeeze your clip, hit the right one. Get past that weed, got the like one. With all them niggas, I got the fight one. All them hoes, I got the like one. Our situation is tight one. What you gonna do? Fight or one. Cheap for me, that can take B. Throw the big nigga, that's on me. I'ma tell you like a nigga told me. Cash roll everything around me, but shit. Lyrically, niggas can't see me. Fuck it. Buy the gold, cook the coke, cut it. Know the bitch before you call yourself number it. Lyrically, y'all niggas can't see me. Biggie said, lyrically, y'all niggas can't see me. He said, Shh. he said, he said, shit, lyrically, niggas can't see me. Fuck it, buy the coke, cook the coke, cut it. Buy the coke, y'all know, y'all know, y'all know. Y'all know Big is synonymous with that coke talk. I feel like Big was the originator for the coke talk. He talked about, he talked about coke so much. He talked about coke so much other than Pusher T. 
Because, you know, Pusha T do the coke rapping too. But Big was synonymously with that. But the thing was, Big was actually selling coke. <laughs> Don't get on my ass, TDG gang. But I only know one. I only know one name of the members from Bone Thugs and Harmony, and that's Busy Bone. I don't know the other two names of the people that was, that was in that was in uh, Bone Thugs and Harmony. Now, is this Busy that's rapping? Because, um, because his flow is crazy. And then the man did the, this is the, this is the, this is the, like his rhyme patterns is crazy. And he ride in his beat. I'm spitting fire, this is the real truth, bitch. Breaking out for lies, my massage. Better be better for all my dead and shit. It's fine, it's wild, bless the child. That whatever came of me, put in positions over the bed. All that I had to do was stay, test me now. Contend never enough, so when I know my time, pick up my pen and my hand. Thought I might just get fun, fun. Marching, we shooting. And my hand, but I might just get run, run. Hey, open a land, see if we free. We all suited, beg my part in the morning. Maybe we ain't marching, we shooting. And then every crew in there's the fuck ball. Every day in the game, we start them up, did it, we hit them up. I'm gonna pay the debt and get the devil. Keep it to the devil. Put it down, it's not a burn. Never be back in the curb. If it ain't that earth, just burn. But I broke his books and give it that last first word. I'm gonna do my bad, cause I gotta get my mask. And she have to put in this 12 gang. So I'm gonna get them all off, nigga, y'all lost. different bro they can rap they got they had the rapping fast plus the harmony too which is a perfect combo second commercial I accidentally turned the fucking song my bad nah I think on this last verse that's busy right if I'm wrong y'all let me know down in the comment section which I will alright let's get it 
That song would never get motherfucking old. That's a classic song. That song is solidified in history, bro. That's a song you will never get enough of listening to. You feel me? Something you can just ride around. That's a that's literally a song that like he would like Bone Thugs was saying. Something you roll around in your car, smoke something, and just vibe to. You feel me? Biggie wasn't really. He really really. It was a chill song. Biggie really wasn't barring as much. But it's just something you abide to, sit back and chill, and just listen to big flow and all they flows and the fast, the fast rapping. Man, it was it was a wonderful song. I, I enjoy listening to that. It's been a while since I listened to that song too, so I had to bring this one for y'all, TDG Gang. I know today's Throwback Thursday. That's the end of this reaction. Make sure y'all hit that like button, hit that comment section, share my video. And hit that big red subscribe button because it's free to come join the family. Hit the post notification bell right next to it to get every motherfucking new video that me Twitter got upload. We over here spreading nothing but love, peace, respect. We are on the road to 1K TDG gang. All my new members out there, follow me on Instagram at Toretta God. Be down in the comment section below. And I see y'all boys and girls in the next motherfucking video.